Hey guys, how's it going? It's Mr. G-Stuff and welcome back. In the last video we did a showcase of this house here behind me. The modern house, more like a modern house with like an open floor plan. It's not really like, I don't know, not a lot of design to it. Just very simple modern house. It's one of my, it's like one of the first I've done in quite a while. So to this episode we're actually going to do a tutorial of it. Um, we're actually just going to go over here a little bit. So, for this tutorial, you're going to need you're going to need white wool. Again, I'm using the City Texture Pack on the Xbox One. You can use whatever texture pack you want. Um, um doesn't really matter what blocks you use. I'm just really showing you how to build it. You can use blocks that have the same color. You can use the same blocks. It's all up to you. Doesn't matter. So, let's go ahead and do this. Um, you need white wool. Uh, you need black wool. And you need quartz slabs. So we have those three. And where's the glass panes? I know they're in here somewhere. Okay, there's glass panes. And we also need oak leaves and wooden door. I think that's pretty much, well, one more thing for this tutorial. It's going to be co cobblestone wall. And I think that's pretty much pretty much everything you're gonna need for this tutorial um, so let's go ahead and start with the doorway I believe it's uh, we'll go start right here so you're gonna take your white wool and you're gonna go one two three let's double check that again one two three four my bad uh, before I do anything let me take some swiftness I did try recording this video before but it got all messed up and everything so now I'm trying again. So we're going to go four and then three up and then three across, three down, obviously, and then four over. So we got our one, two, three, four. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. And then counting the corner block, that's one, two, three, four. Okay. And then. The front here, the front's going to be crazy when we get up all on this stuff right here. But trust me, it'll be it'll be simpler than you think it is. So counting this corner block, it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And there isn't usually a block right here, but we're going to put one any, anyway. Uh, there's usually this cobblestone design right here. Or not cobblestone. That's actually quartz. My bad. Quartz design here. But we're going to go ahead and put the eighth block right there. So three, four, five, six, seven, eight across. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I probably should have written, written this all down or something like that, but oh well. And then counting this one, you've got one, two, three, four, five, six. And counting that inside corner in there, that's going to be seven. And then counting that one, that's one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So we got seven and then twelve to the right. So seven back and then twelve to the right. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then the counting that one, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. All right. See, really easy. Oh, hold on, I got a pop up on my screen. All right, continuing. So we got this wall, awesome. Now we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and then counting this one: one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and then counting the inside corner. That's twelve. So obviously, this is kind of like a 12 by 11 room in there yes and then four that way okay we'll get there so 11 then 12 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 and then 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 and it should line up right there which it does awesome and then um this little wall i saw there that's what is it? Four, counting that one. So one, two, three, four. We'll double check when we go over there. Yes, counting that corner one. One, 
two, three, four. Okay, we got that. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, and count, oh, seven, actually, if you count that inside corner. So seven, and then count the inside corner, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So seven, and then eight. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then was it eight this way? Let me double check. Yes, eight this way. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let me double check. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Awesome. Now we just got the back wall here, which I last time I checked it was fifteen. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Look at that, fifteen. Take it. All right, so 15 blocks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. And then that pretty much just goes all the way up and it's gonna line up with this right here. So we'll just take that. So that's gonna be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. That's going to be 24. So it's pretty much just going to line up with this doorway right here. All right. Now's the back of the garage, kind of. Uh, so counting this corner block here, that's one, two, three, and then skip one four, five, six, and then an inside corner, seven. So three, skip one, four, five, six, seven. So one, two, three, skip one, four, five, six, seven. Awesome. And then for the back wall, we have counting that inside corner, one, two, three, four. Oh, you know what? We just connected it. That's it. Just connect it straight to this wall right here. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then counting that one, it's a nine. So we're good there. And then pretty much, let me show you guys something real quick. Let me see something. Just checking something. Okay. Right here by the doorway, we're going to leave this two middle one right here. Now there's four blocks. We're going to leave those two open. We're not going to double layer the white here. It's actually going to be open because the leaves are going to go there. And on these three right here in front of the doorway, that's going to be open as well because the leaves are going to go there. So, I mean, it's going to layer up behind it. I'm trying to think of the best way to do this, Marines. Actually, let's just start off by doing this. You are going to keep your white wool again, and you're actually going to go double layering the white around again. So you're going to do a second layer. And for this part of the garage right here, you're only going to put the white wool right here on the ends, the two ends right here. And then you're going to continue here at the corner here. And then you're just going to take it all the way around. All the way around. So anyway, guys, um, sorry I didn't upload yesterday. Uh, like I said, the video messed up. And then I got called into work shortly afterwards. So I didn't have time to redo it. So here it is now. Um... Hopefully, I'm working. I'm thinking of something else. What to work on? I don't know quite yet. I actually don't know. Do I want to double up over here? Yeah. Make sure you double up on the garage too. And then we're gonna stop right there, and then st stop right here, because we're gonna figure out the window things. Window things. Um, let's build up the leaves real quick because those are a little annoying. So you got your oak leaves. Let's see. You got the two middle ones, and that's one, two, three. Is it one, two, three, four high? Same with these ones. One, two, three, four high. All right, let's do that real quick. One, two, three. And then on these three, one, two, three. Awesome. Okay, now we gotta figure out if we get this front out of the way, it'll be so much easier. 
So, it's going to be black wool, and we're going to start here, like next to the uh, leaves there, and we're going to go up three, then we have a little square pattern here, and then we're going to go across three, four, five, six, and then down one. So up three, cross six, down one. Do this. One, two, three, and then just put a square there. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, and then down one. And then I believe this fills in with white wool. Yes. And this as well? Yes. Let me double check. And it does. Awesome. So then you're going to take your glass pane and you're just going to fill this in right here. So it should, should be six windows right there. And then I believe we just take the black all the way around. Yes, we do. Awesome. So everywhere where there's black, well, Everywhere where the second layer, the second layer of white, you're just going to take two layers of black on top of all that. After we get all the layering on here, uh, remember for the garage here, you leave all this open until we get to the uh, roof. After we get all the layering uh, on the walls, then we can punch out the holes for the uh, windows and uh, doors. Except for that front window. We already did that because once we get it out of the way, everything's so much easier, I guarantee you. So anyway guys, um, if there's like a build you want to show off and you want me to see it, you know, just like leave a comment below and I'll get in contact with you. Maybe we can actually, I can come over to your world, world and check it out or uh, maybe if it's like a PC build or something like that, uh, we can find a way for me to download it and I can convert it for the uh, Xbox. Um, anyway, go ahead and place a second layer of black wool on top of that. Cause I really want to see what um, what everyone builds. Like I'm curious on all different kinds of builds and everything everyone makes. And I'm going to try uploading a video like every day. Maybe not every day, but maybe every other day. Pretty sure you guys get tired of it if it was every day. And I'd run out of ideas if it was every day. Every day, to be honest. Um, so we're gonna finish up this black wool right here. I'm just going to go on top right here in this corner. Awesome. Look at that. Now, I'm going to figure out something for you. This back here, you're going to bring this black wool over one more, and it's going to go behind. Behind like that? Yes. It's going to wrap behind the uh, grass or, or leaves right there. I don't know why I keep saying grass. It's going to wrap behind the leaves, and then you're just going to bring it all the way down to the, to the ground. Just like that. So the only thing that I'll show on the leaves inside here is the top blocks. And I believe that's where uh, that's where the white's going to start. Yeah. Okay. And I believe the inside on this one as well is the same. You're going to put the black right there. Uh, hold on a second. Let me go check. Okay, it does look like black goes all the way around. Yes. Awesome. So, the two blocks behind the, uh, next to the top, you know, not exactly behind the top block, but right below it. Just going to do that all the way down to the ground. I think I did that right. Seems strange. Nope, that's right. White's going to stack on top of it. Okay, we're good. Alright, so now we're going to take our white wool again. And this white wool, this first layer we're going to be doing, is actually going to be finishing off the garage. And then it continues on to the rest. Um, so let's go ahead and build on top of the garage right here. One layer of white wool. You know what? I forgot something here. Let's take this black wool and put it in this doorway right here because the doorway is not going to be four high. It's only going to be two blocks high. All right. Awesome. 
So we got our white wool here. Oh, we actually forgot to put another layer of black wool right there. That's good. And then one layer of white wool. And you can actually connect it right here for this garage here. And then what you're going to do is you're going to fill it in. Yes, fill it in. Come on. All right. Awesome. I just realized I don't have any swiftness on right now. That's good. And then I believe, yes, yes, we do. Okay. We're going to take our quartz slabs and going along the front here, starting right here, not in the corner, you're going to go all the way around, except for when you come back here, you're not going to go to the back part right here. You're going to go one in and just place your, place your quartz slabs. And again, you don't go on here either. You just go all the way down one in. Because this part right here and this part right here are actually going to keep going up. So if you put, put quartz slabs right there, that's just going to mess it up. See, because this wall is going to keep going up up to the roo main roof, actually. And then we can actually continue with our white wool. Make sure you put it on the inside here, right behind the uh, grass. And just take it all, all the way around. If I stutter at all, guys, or if my words sound strange, my mouth gets pretty, like, my throat gets pretty dry. Like, I had to drink a lot of water, I swear struggle just to say stuff. All right. In my last video, I actually said gra grass. I think it was grass. I said grass really weird, and my friend was making fun of me. It's actually pretty funny. It was like grass. Something like that. Grass. I don't make a lot of tutorials, and this is the first tutorial I've made in actually quite a while. All right, so we got that white wool there. Then we're just going to make a second layer on everything we just did. See now how that kind of makes like a wall there? Remember, you're not building on top of the uh, leaves there. Uh, let me double check something real quick. Okay. Um, you're not putting a white wool on this corner block right here next to the leaves. You're actually going to put a quartz slab. So it kind of continues out around the corner right there. And then you're going to put the white wool around it, so just continuing on like that. And all the way around, just like we did the first layer. Alright, um, so I do have another channel. usually play like other games on there, like Call of Duty, Grand Theft Auto, whatever kind of games I can find. But, um... I really haven't done anything on there lately, and I'm actually getting kind of screwed over with the partnership I have. So I really just want to avoid my main channel because of the partnership that's not doing too well for me, and they're not doing what they promised. So, all right, moving on. Let's get this. Uh, did we forget this room? No, we didn't. You know what? I forgot to mention something. I just realized that. Right here on this extended part right here, you're actually going to take out the second layer of white wool. Make sure you leave this here. This is the main wall right here. So just these three walls, you're going to take out the second layer of white wool. I completely forgot about that. My bad, guys. And then what you're going to do, extend this over. Hey, come on. So we're going to fill this in. I'm not worrying about this part right here because that's an inside wall and I don't remember what it looks like so we'll just get to it anyway. We'll get there when we get there. It's probably the same as the outside because the pattern I just kept cons consistent. I want to say constant. Alright, cool. So you got that filled in and then you're going to take your quartz slabs again and you're just going to go all the way around. probably be easier if you do it this way because if you would have not put the second layer up and you would have had it like this you probably would have put quartz slabs all the way over but you don't want to do that 
because again, this wall keeps going up. And do we want to put quartz slabs right here? Let me double check. Yes, we do. Awesome. Quartz slabs right here. All here. All here. 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 All right. Cool. So the garage is done. Um, well, actually, one little thing I want to point out: garage. Bring, get your cobblestone wall, and in this corner right here, on the last black wool and the uh, white wool right here, you're just going to place a cobblestone wall just in the corner there, kind of little design. And the same with this corner here, the back left corner, cobblestone wall. Just cool looking design right there. So I believe we move on to the black wool next, and then one layer of white wool. Really easy, guys. So you got two layers of black wool, and then one layer of white wool, and that's pretty much going to be it. And then we got to punch out the stuff, and that'll probably be the episode. Awesome. So as I was saying about my other channel, um, I do have a partnership there, and I'm not going to say the name, but um, they haven't really kept up with their promises. I tried leaving the chan leaving them. Actually, I might not be with them right now. I haven't checked in a while. But even when I was trying, they weren't letting me leave, and it was really annoying, and I didn't know what to do, so I just stopped uploading on there because... They weren't doing what they promised. They weren't paying out like they promised. I, I don't really care much about it, but still, that's it's messed up. So, if I need to, you know, if I really want to upload like other games or something like that, maybe I'll upload a different game here like once a week or something like that. Or if I, re if you guys really want to see stuff like that, I'll even make another channel because the chances of me going on that channel again are pretty slim, even though I have quite a few subscribers. But that's really not as important right now. Um, so anyway, guys, yeah, you got your second layer of black wool. You're just going to start on one layer of white wool. So yeah, if I don't upload like every day, it's probably because I work. And to be honest, uploading every day isn't actually that great because eventually you get tired of the person. So if you have like a day in between, you kind of get anxious to see what their next video is going to be like oh all okay, right i can't wait till their next video you know otherwise if you like they upload a video or two videos a day then you kind of get tired of them and it's just eh, that guy's not as great anymore all right so we have a one layer of white wool on the top here and now we're just going to fill it in from that one layer you oops from that one layer you put in so just fill in all the way in So I don't know if you guys watch other channels on Minecraft, but um, my friend Dustin, or Attends, most of you guys know him by, he's also doing Minecraft. He's a, he's like almost 500 subscribers right now. He passed me up like crazy. He passed up my main channel. That was like the second time he passed me up, I swear. Um, Go get, check him out, guys. I'm sure most of you probably already know him because he actually told you to check me out. Huh. Also, oh, I was trying to think. I have a Twitter. Um, it, it's not really that active. I was thinking of actually making another Twitter just for Minecraft, but I'll leave the one I have right now in the, descri uh, in the description if you guys want to check it out. Message me, tweet me, whatever. Uh, maybe you have like a Snapchat, or Snapchat, really. A snapshot of like a uh, build you did or something like that and you just want me to see, then you know, I can check it out and... Maybe you want me to see it in the game or whatnot. That'd be pretty cool. All also, I know this isn't that great of a modern house. It's just a very simple modern house with not much interior design or really any much design on it. It's just very simple and open floor plan. But I have ideas for other ones. It's just right now, you know, I'm just going, this is my first one in a while. So hopefully you guys still like it all right we'll finish up this roof right here come on you need to like increase the reach distance for building and destroying that'd be great all right once you have that filled in you're going to take your quartz slabs and you're going to go all the way around what you just did make sure uh, when you get to a spot like oh, i'll show you when you get to a spot like this 
you actually get that corner block too. Otherwise, if you don't have in there, it looks kind of weird. So anyway, let's go all the way around. Look at that, I got an invite. I figured it was from him. <laughs> that would be Lassadora, or Mike. He uh, usually invites me like the second I get on Xbox. All right, so that's filled in, and we're about 25 minutes in. That's still good. We have plenty of time to punch out the windows and everything. Um, so let's go ahead and do this. We'll start with these windows here. There's two blocks above that doorway, and we got one pane window. Okay. And then from here, we go one, two. We're not going to count the quarter ones anymore. But we got one, two, and then on three and four, we punch them out. And on the bottom black, we punch them out above that, too. So three and four. So we punch this out, cause pain, and then one, two, three and four. Boom, boom. Just like that. Really easy. If you guys ever want me to like slow down on my videos, just let me know and I, I could try my best, you know. All right, so one, two above the doorway. There would be two blocks above the doorway and then one, two, three glass panes. So you get two blocks above the doorway and then one, two, three. So the top one's going to go into the bottom layer of black. Awesome. And then I believe this window that's above here is going to be the same as this one, it's just you're skipping the black, and it's going to go in the two layers of white here. So it's going to be one, two, three, one, two, three, fill that in. So it's going to be six glass panes, and it's directly above the bottom one. And then windows right here. All right. So in the third, fourth, five, and six block, we'll break them and the ones above it. third, fourth, five, and six. So four panes there. My phone is going crazy whenever I record, I swear. So on the top layer of black on this side right here, top layer of black, we're gonna have one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven is what we're gonna break. So five, six, and seven. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Awesome. And what did I say this was again? Five and six on this one. Okay. So we're going to do the same thing over here. Five and six. So one, two, three, four, five, and six. All right. So that's part that part right there. Um, There's one little part I got to do real quick. Okay, because I left this out last time I tried doing this video, I swear. This extended part right here. Um, from this corner here, you're going to take your black wool because it starts on the top layer to black wool. And it's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Obviously. Okay. So 8 and then 15. So starting on this top right here, this top layer of black, you're going to go, so that's two, or is that one? Oh, I forget. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, okay, that's one. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then it should be 15 across, so we'll just make sure. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, and then connect it. Connect it. Awesome. And then you're gonna take it pretty much just wrap how it's right there all the way around. Because this is actually the two rooms that I showed in a showcase that I said you could also make into one room. It's all up to you guys how you want to do this. Um, like you don't have to do exactly how I do. You can tweak it a little bit if you want. You can even make a basement if you want. Which I th actually I probably should have done something like that. Oh well. And this does go all the way up. And the last time I tried recording this, I actually left it out completely. But since we still have like a minute or so, I don't want to make this like too long. I don't want to bore you guys. You can actually, if you want, you can even skip the parts where I'm just filling in. All right. 
So we'll do that. One layer of white, and then fill it in. Yes, those quartz slabs right there are actually going to come out, and they're actually just going to continue on to the part we just made. So go ahead and fill this in on the top layer of white like you did on the other part of the roof. Very easy, guys. This house is actually very simple to make. Um, I will have other houses. I really look forward to getting into uh, Victorian. But not just Victorian, but I uh, I can't remember this one design I saw. It was really, like, I don't know. I really don't know how to describe it. I really liked it. I'll look it up for you guys. And I really want to make a house like that. Actually, maybe a mixed with a modern. But I need more practice for modern until I do something like that. All right. So we broke out that wall of quartz slabs or whatever, and we continued all the way over here. So now you're going to take your cobblestone wall, and you're going to bring down in the corner here. You're just going to bring it down all the way down to the ground. So it should be, I think it was three. So one, two, three. And I know you're probably wondering about this. Right here, just take your black wool and just fill it in. It's, they're small rooms. If you watch the showcase, you'll see they're kind of small rooms. Because I believe on top of this uh, black wool, I have flooring. Wow. That would actually make a nice, uh, nice master bedroom, I tell you what. Yeah, see? That'd be pretty cool for like one bedroom. I feel weird if a house has like one bedroom. I feel like a big house like this should have more than one, like two or three. But then I always have a hard time like fitting in an extra room or something like that. Anyway, we're going to finish off the windows here. We're already like over a half hour or so. So, for this window right here, we're going to go on. Well, we didn't even get any of these windows. Oh, my goodness. All right. We got this window. On this wall, one, two. So three, four, and five, we're gonna break it, and then above those too, awesome. So, one, two, three, four, five, and then above those, break it. Break it good. And I think it's the same, you just skip a block and the same above it, yes. So we'll, we'll get over there. And then on this wall, on the bottom layer black, one, two, and on three and four, we're breaking it. So we'll do that real quick. One, two, three, and four. All right, and then, like I said, this is the same as that one. Same on the front, actually. I never even realized I did that. Wow. Never even realized I actually lined up the windows without thinking about it. Like I said, I built this house, like, just randomly. I wasn't even thinking. I just started building, ran, randomly building. And look at that. They lined up. All right, this window here. Um... Three, four, five, and six. Very simple. Three, four, five, and six. Put that in. And we have one more window here, and then we have a couple on the top. So from this corner right here, we got one, two, three, four, five, and six, and then above that. So let's go over here. Oops. One, two, three, four, five, and six, and above that. And let's get the windows for upstairs. So right here, this one, it's going to be one, two, three, four, and five in both layers of the black. So four and five on both layers of the black. One, two, three, four, and five. Sweet. All right. That looks pretty weird with just the uh, black floor in there. And then on these ones, it's going to be one, two, three. Again, both layers of the black. Uh, three, four, and five. Three, four, and five. Okay, got it. And then three, four, and five. We got this, guys. So, one, two, three, four, and five. And then from this corner, one, two, three. Three, four, and five. 
And then from this corner, one, two, three, four, and five. And I believe that's all the windows. Let me do a circle round. And yes, that's all the windows and the doors. Now we just put this quartz slab thingy in here real quick, which is real simple. I'll just show you guys real quick. So on the front here, uh, what you're going to do is you're going to just, actually just take out this corner, this whole entire corner, except for that top slab. Yeah, you're going to leave in that top slab that goes the whole way around the building. So, just take it all the way down. Awesome. And then for the quartz slabs, it's just going to be the bottom part of each block. See how just the bottom part right there? Right there, just the bottom. Just the bottom slab. That's all you need going all the way up. Just like that. All right, guys. I think that's, I think that's it. Did we get the uh, window on the back part of the garage? Yes, we did. So we're going to call that an episode here. On the next episode, we're going to start on the inside. We're going to do the uh, walls I need done in there, the uh, upstairs and everything. I think we can actually finish the inside in just one episode. This was actually a long episode, but I didn't want to cut it off too early. Um, you know what? Let me put the doors in real quick. They go from the inside. Awesome. Okay. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, leave a like if you did. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you in the next one, which is going to be the inside tutorial on this. So peace out, guys.